Hello, I am Jacob and this is Theoretical Drinking. Today, I'm going to show you how to make a drink that I'm pretty sure I made up myself. I don't know, maybe it exists out there. But I call it the Peppy Slow Gin Fizz. For those of you who do not know what a slow gin fizz is, it is a drink made with slow gin. And you basically you put slow gin in a glass and top it with either uh, soda water or some people will top it with Sprite. It's a, it's a nice drink, it's tasty, but I'm going to change it up a little bit. So, uh, let's get started. Well, that's a lot of ice, whatever. First thing, got some ice in my glass, and here's my measuring cup. I'm going to take and put in two ounces of slow gin. Now, I'm using uh, Hiram Walker, the Hiram Walker brand slow gin. And the thing about this, uh, specifically about Hiram Walker, they are, not, I don't want to say low end, uh, they're, they're a reasonably priced uh, maker of various cordials. Uh, cordials are basically anything that's not just straight brewed, um, like vodka or whiskey or something of that nature. Uh, but the thing is, about two years ago, I think it was, a year ago, two years ago, back then, their bottle, if you actually flipped it around and looked at the, uh, what it says and everything like this, um, back here it said, made with real uh, grape juice or something like that, and now it says, colored with grape skin extract and certified color. So, before it was clearly fake slow gin, because slow gin, actual slow gin, is gin, that is then infused with what are called uh, slow, which is, I believe, Welsh for blackthorn berries, which I guess is a type of berries that you get up in the UK or something like that. I don't know. <clears throat> but uh, now it doesn't. It doesn't say grape uh, grape juice. It says colored with grape skin extract, which is reasonable. I mean, you know, they want to make it nice and bright colored, but. So I don't know if it is now real slow gin or not. It, it doesn't quite taste like slow gin, but on the other hand, I don't know. Regardless of whether or not it is actual slow gin, it's very tasty. <clears throat> so I'll go ahead and put in my two ounces there. And then I'm going to add, this is peppermint schnapps. Uh, it's peppermint with alcohol in it, basically. It's very tasty. It's good for adding a little bit of a zip to a drink that you're making. But you want to be careful with it. This stuff is powerful, and I don't mean it's powerfully alcoholic. It's not. It's only like 15%, 30%, whatever. It's still not powerfully alcoholic. No, it is powerfully pepperminty. If you are not careful, this will take over your drink, and you will be just drinking liquid peppermint. So, I'm going to go ahead and open that. I'm going to have to clean this half off after the, I'm done recording. And we're going to put in just half an ounce of this. I'm not kidding. It will take over your drink if you're not careful. <clears throat> so we'll go ahead, put that in, and drip, 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 all right. And now we will take our shaker, and we'll go ahead and shake. nice and frosty and I think I had a bit of a leak there. I've got some uh, red splotchiness on my surface here. Anything behind me? No? Okay, that's good. Do, 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 do. Alright, go ahead and put that there. <clears throat> and you want a chilled glass. I like to use the martini glass. It's very classy. And uh, because I don't put any ice in this. So the martini glass fits, because you generally don't put ice in your martini glass. I'm going to go ahead and pour that in. You'll note it's very red. Uh, that is one of the things that I definitely like about Hiram Walker, uh, the Hiram Walker's slow gin. Even if it's not, it's very pretty. And then I'm going to go ahead and take my Sprite here, <coughs> pop that open, and just... Ooh, top it off with Sprite, 
There we go. And that is your Peppy Slow Gin Fizz. The Peppy obviously uh, refers to the fact that you use peppermint schnapps and also kind of that you use Sprite. Because like I said, officially a Slow Gin Fizz is made with uh, soda water, not Sprite. But sometimes people make it with soda water, I mean with uh, pe uh, Sprite you know, or some kind of lemon lime soda. And there is absolutely nothing wrong with that. Make your drink how you like to drink it. So we'll go ahead and have a sip of this. And it's delicious. It's kind of got a generic berry flavor to it. It's probably a, an artifact of, of again, the higher mockers. I really need to do some research and figure out if this is actually slow gin. Because another thing, they used to have pictures of grapes across the front of the bottle. And now it has these blueberry looking things, which I believe are blackthorn berries. So, I don't know. Maybe it's legit now. But regardless, it's still delicious. And I still love drinking this. So, it's a pretty short video today. Uh, not a whole lot going on. Just a little... I'm actually recording this on Saturday, but I'm not posting it up till Monday. Because, you know, everybody goes to work on Monday. And then you come back and you just want to kill some brain cells. So, you don't really want to kill some brain cells on, on uh, Monday. But, uh... The, the really nice thing about this is it's very tasty, it's very refreshing. It's got that, just a hint, just the barest hint. Uh, you might not even be able to identify it as peppermint if you don't know that there's peppermint in there. Uh, but it's, it's very, very refreshing. It's kind of got a zip to it. And it's not hugely alcoholic. You absolutely can't taste alcohol in here at all. <clears throat> and so it's a nice, uh, a nice little after work cocktail. It's refreshing, you know, kick back have a sip, do whatever you do in the afternoon after work, and uh, it's just it's just very good for that sort of thing, for a relaxing, uh, you know, work week style drink when you still have to be in shape to get up and go to work the next day. So, yeah, here it is. The Peppy Slow Gin Fizz. Uh, if you guys are enjoying my videos, feel free to leave lots of comments down below in the comments section. I will do my very best to reply to them. And of course, like my video and subscribe to my channel, etc, etc, personal plugging. I do have a uh, Tumblr. It is... I've forgotten my own Tumblr. It's linked somewhere on my page. Uh, should be theoretical drinking... Uh, yeah, should be theoretical drinking, you know, that Tumblr, that uh, com. So, yeah, you can go ahead and do a, do a search for theoretical drinking on uh, Tumblr and you'll find me. So, yeah, that will be all for today. Peppy Slow Gin Fizz. I am Jacob, this is Theoretical Drinking, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.